Hello my viewers. I want to talk a little bit about flaring today. See now here's a a set of flare and swedge tools right here. Now, let's say you need to flare. Uh, this is a, an older set by the way. So let's say you had to flare um, some 3 8 inch copper tubing. You'd First of all you'd have to ream the copper tubing okay and then set it in this uh, flare or swedge block and until you get a little bit above the um, the block itself okay and then crank down um, on the uh, the block to lock in the copper tubing. By the way, that's after you put this forged nut on over the copper tubing. Uh, some people claim they've never forgot about doing that, but everybody does. Either that or you're a freak of nature. So okay, now so with this flaring uh, head, you can then. Uh, let's see, get this going back here and I'm gonna go back a little bit further. Oh my gosh. Um, there. Okay, and then you lock it in position and you can flare your fitting, okay? And many of you out there have done this in the past and have found that this system doesn't really work that well. Um, I mean, if anything, this just does nothing but make leaks, just makes life hard. What I have here is the Pro Set by CPS. This makes things worth flaring. So what I'll do first of all is I'll take this 3 8 inch copper tubing, put the flare nut or forge nut um, on here, and then set the uh, flare tool up so that I can put the uh, copper tubing in the 3 8 slot and just a little bit of, and set it up so that just is just a little bit of copper tubing coming over about the size of a dime or nickel or something up just above the flaring block and then I can set the flare over the this here and then uh, tighten it down where it's set for three eighths. After that, once it's nice and tight in the block I can uh, flare it. With the Pro Set you don't have to ream the copper tubing. It reams it on its own. All you have to do then is turn the crank here till you can kind of feel a click that will tell you that it's finished flaring. There. there. Hear that click? Now that means that it's done. And now I can back out the flare tool out of the copper tubing. And I'll tell you something, this flare tool almost makes it enjoyable to do flares. Okay, I dreaded make, doing flares until I got this tool. And now I don't mind it at all. So, let's see here. Here we go. Okay, here here we go. Here's the flare. 
and I can put the forged nut over it and it fits just right ready to go I have full confidence that this would not leak